Hello again all you lovely Top Gear people and welcome back behind the scenes. It's a bit of a special week this week because we've got not one but two stars in our reasonably priced car. Now the next time you see these guys on screen will be in their new movie Focus but just for now ladies and gentlemen would you believe it Margot Robbie and Will Smith. It's really fun. It's so nerve-wracking but it's really fun. <laughs> There's a lot of difficult bits. It's really hard to, to slow, like to keep your foot on the accelerator until the last minute and then slam on the brakes. It's, and I keep going to indicate, which is not going to help me here at all. What kind of a driver are you usually? Are you quite confident? I get a fair few speeding fines, but yeah, so I'm a little impatient maybe, but I think relatively safe. I'm so sorry. Can you just tell us what happened? So I'm never invited back to do this show again. I, um, I, I, I overshot the corner a little bit. I'm, I may have almost um, hit Ian, the cameraman. Um, I didn't, fortunately, so uh, could have been worse. So was it just that the car went out of control? Yeah, I was just, I just wasn't concentrating. It, I just overshot it. I don't, I don't, I'm not sure what happened. Oh, I thought everyone was going to tell me to get out of the car and I wasn't allowed to, like, keep racing. Am I allowed to do more laps? We've got Will Smith coming down a bit later on. Is he here yet? Did he see that? I don't think so. Okay, good. As long as he didn't see that. Please, no one tell him I did that. What's he doing? Are you going to pass on any wisdom from your... Uh... No, I don't want to give him any pointers. I want to beat him. Is this a co-star rivalry thing? Oh, there's massive. Yeah, we're both very competitive, so I'd really like to be better than him at something. Just no one tell him about the cameraman, please. Just tell him I did a really good time. Actually, tell him I did a really bad time so he doesn't try to beat my good time. What's up? What's the Huh? You scared? That's what I do. Only thing that's weird is it's on the other side. Oh, so if you lose, that's going to be your excuse as to why you lost? Uh, duh. So this is going to be a, a, a case of healthy competition, is it? Yeah, well, or, or unhealthy, depending on how she wants it, you know, because she, she's pretty competitive, you know? And I, I don't have a problem beating a girl. Yeehaw! Oh, Have you done any track driving before? Uh, none. But this, this, but you know, I feel confident that as an actor, I've seen enough that I'll be able to act like I'm a, a good stunt driver. So that's what I'm going to go for. I'm going to give the performance of my life. You said you were going to try and get into that actor mode of a of a speech. Yeah, that was that's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was the none of that, none of that works. And um, and I'm scared to see what my face looks like on this camera right here. There is no actor face going on right now. There's no cool points being won behind the wheel of this car. Blue that one. Blue that one. Flat out through those through those turns is uh that's uh that's rugged. I have a whole new new respect for this. I'm I'm uh I'm friends with Lewis Hamilton, so I'm going to call him as soon as I've done in time. I have a new, a whole new respect for his gig. Ah, damn it. You know, it felt really good right up until I was in the dirt. It happens to the best of us. It happens to the best of us. Uh, you know, me and my uh, world-class racing counterparts, you know, something we talk about all the time, you know, where you get, you get excited and it's the last turn. You're coming into that last turn and you know you got it. You know you got your best time and you get a little too aggressive. 